Hello, guys. You know who it is, right? They probably don't. Hmm. Anyways, today we're going to be playing Portal 2. And in this video, well, in the last video, Wheatley kind of betrayed us, you know? And um, we finally meet Cave Johnson, the really cool guy that used to own Aperture, you know? And, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So today I thought I'd actually, before, if, uh, today I thought I, before I start the video, I thought I'd do a room tour and, uh, also review some comments. So here we go. So yeah, this is like all my computers. This is where I edit my videos totally. Um, this is like one of my super awesome 80s fart computer, 9000. And, uh, this is where I play games right now. I've got, uh, something. I don't know what it is. Oh, I just shot it. Okay, I'm gonna have to buy a new computer. But, yeah, they're just, like, the best computers ever, and they're just so amazing. Yeah, they're totally not fake. I'm totally not Gmod. And, yes, I'm carrying a crowbar. What are you gonna do about it? Uh, oh, and this is just where I read comments. And they're, they're, here's the camera that I have set up. So, yeah, uh, yeah, that was the room tour. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, and now that I've done that, uh, we can go read some comments. Eh. All right. Oh, and there's probably not going to be a lot because you know I I just turned on the comments recently. But anyways, let let's just read them. Oh my god! I love me some of this quality content. Like, please do more, please, and please like do it, please, and also maybe add Jimmy Chalangas for scientific reasons or something. I don't know. I just love this, this channels. It is pretty lit and stuff and please do more and maybe please do a vid on more skyrim yay please oh my god yes please <laughs> my freaking table broke but anyways uh thanks for the comment i i will probably do uh some more uh skyrim and you know what here's a chimichanga for you yep this is what you wanted <laughs> are you happy now are you satisfied <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's take a look at one more comment. I'm droning this on too much. I have plenty other videos to do this in. I just gotta go... Where'd the computer go anyways? <laughs> All your time waiting For that second chance For a break that would make it okay There's always I'm sorry. That was just really sad. In the arms of the angels, indeed. Well, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Play it. This is really how we live. Yo, what up guys, this is Dragonite here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be playing some more Portal 2. Oh, okay, there was something on my foot. <laughs> okay. Uh, no. Uh, eh. So last time, Wheatley was a little shite and betrayed us. So, uh, let's see what happens. We're down in the deep, deep feet. Uh, why is it crashing? Uh, anyways, um, we were down in the deep, deep facility. And... Aw, I was talking to my friend, uh, he said, Portal 3 confirmed, I'm like, oh, really? And, yeah, he was lying. One sec. Alright, so, yeah, we're down here, it's looking all crazy, the tinfoil rock, whatever this is. Wait, there was a sign over here, what did this say? Danger. Do not lean on railing, if I do. What if I do? It's not doing anything. Absolute thuggery. I gotta sit up in my chair, I'm a sloucher. Whoa. What is happening over there? Whoa. This is huge. Holy crap. Wow, okay. Wow, okay. 
What is happening in this place? Like, bruh. Wait, there's a smashed open door over here. Am I supposed to go in here? I think I am. Ooh, what's gonna happen? Oh. Welcome, gentlemen, to <gasps> it's Gabe Johnson! Oh my god! Yeah. Yes, I am the best. Not, not to, not to <laughs> gloat about it. That famous line, though. <laughs> to science. Sorry, fellas. She's married. To science. Um. Okay. I think I'm supposed to get over here. And look at that. Uh, hopefully, I'm supposed to drop from there. Uh, maybe there's somewhere up, somewhere where I'm actually supposed to go. Can I put a portal over here, though? No, I can't. All right. Wait, how am I supposed to get down from here? I guess I have to jump down over here. Frick. Okay. Well, that's all right. Ah! Sorry about screaming like that. It scared me. Start. I was very startled. Okay. Let's try and do this. Come on. Oh, that was awesome. I flew right through there. Through that. I forgot you can't uh, use a ping tool in single player mode. I'm I'm sorry, I was playing a lot of Portal 2 co-op. I just finished the main story with my friend. I'm gonna, I'm, I might try and record, uh, hold on, I'm gonna let him talk. That's pretty screwed up. That sounds really screwed up. Cave Johnson. I feel like this is a actual dude from the 50s. This was broken into. By who? Spirit of Idaho. National Potato Board Award. Oh, cool. And look, there's a golden potato. Spirit of Idaho, da 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 1955. Local entrepreneur. I can't. I can't read all this. Local entrepreneur buys salt mine. Gabe Johnson to bring science industry to Upper Michigan. Okay, so th it is confirmed, guys. Portal Two takes place in Michigan. The future is here, and it's under the Earth's crust. Says Science Maverick. Cool. Shower curtain salesman of 1943. Gabe Johnson. Aperture fixtures. Okay, that's right. It was originally aperture fixtures. They sold shower curtains made of asbestos. Yes, I know some of the backstory. I've watched, uh, as I said in a previous video, I watch uh, Harry101 UK, and he does a lot of cool Portal 2 stuff, which I adore his work. Mechanical Engineering World's Journal, Top 100 applied science companies 1949 aperture science number two wait who's number one <gasps> black mesa them bastards okay um <laughs> cave johnson shower curtain salesman of 1940 okay aperture fixtures huh so that that's kind of cool it was actually originally aperture fixtures oh Creepy doors opening on their own. I don't like it. Okay. 
I'm actually gonna look a bit around back here. Because I'm curious. Oh, little typewriters and phones and all that. That's cool. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Well. Interesting. Okay, so you just found a lot of backstory there. Kind of cool. Oh, we're in this massive place again. There I was down there. I bet you I could jump down there if I wanted to, but I don't know if I would want. I don't know if I really want to. Cause then I have to go through all that crap again. We going on the elevator now? Oh, sweet. But how is the elevator still able to work, even though it's been like a lot of years? And how is everything not full of weeds and stuff? You know, like, well, maybe it's because it's so far underground, I guess. But the newer facility, facility is pretty far underground too. I don't get how. That, okay. I guess this is just really freaking far underground. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I want to land in there. I think that's poisonous goo. Um, I have a feeling I'm gonna need to put my portal there. Hold on a sec. I gotta bring my mic closer to my mouth. There we go. What's down here? I don't want to go down, but. Oh, okay, there's a surface down there. Okay, my back really hurts. There, it helps a little bit. Okay, I see how this is gonna go down. God dang it, okay, I'm just gonna jump. Whee! Oh my gosh, ah Wow. All right then. Why does the door close on its own? This is the Stanley Parable all over again. Pump Station Alpha. Oh, I never know. Huh. I've seen pictures of this and I never noticed this. And as I said in previous videos, I have played the campaign before, but it's been so long and I don't remember much. So. But I do remember some things. Like Cave Johnson, he's like, he's just a legend. Okay, so I'm supposed to press that. Is this gonna open up? Okay, thank you. I have a feeling I need to go up here because I see a catwalk. Okay. The thing is over here. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand holding. Well, that's pretty cool. At least you don't do, like, uh, fake science, basically. At least they know. They just experiment. It's experiments. As crazy as Aperture's experiments were, it it was testing stuff. You know that's science. So can't really blame him for all the crazy stuff he did to people and all that. But I guess the world is just too hard on him. Yay! I know what that is. I can't pretend I don't know what that is. Joking I, I I used it in the co-op story, so I know. Tragic, but informative, or so I'm told. Okay. We. Awesome. Old button. Ha. That was awesome. No, oh, come on. Oh, 
All right, sorry, I was quiet there. Ye the lab boys just informed me that I should that was really not fun. have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. <laughs> Bill's here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. Oh wow! What a savage. All right. We're at 12 minutes. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. Oh. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. What? Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. What? So if I step on this, am I like... Okay, I think, I think, I don't know. I'm surprised, like, if this gel has been here for, like, a long time, I'm surprised it hasn't, like, degraded or something after all this time, you know? Hmm. Weird. Oh, f farts. Thank God I got on there in time. All right. Whee! Ah, stop it. Wait, what? What's this? Oh, I see I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to jump. Oh, I did that perfect timing. Dang. Wait, what am I doing here? Wait, oh, am I supposed? Oh, this will be fun. Oh, wait, I did something like this in co op. Woohoo! This is fun, bouncing off the walls, literally. Not just because I have tons of sh sugar, you know. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> I can go backwards. It's awesome. Wait, is this cube gonna disappear if I go through? Okay, I guess not. Good. Okay. Woohoo! I love the repulsion gel, it's so oh, fun. In case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. Oh, God. I haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this. It's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Oh. That's not good at all. Well, I wonder what will happen if I get sprayed in that stuff, because I have created some um, community test chambers of my own, and um, I've gotten, like, uh, pumping out repulsion gel. And, uh... Spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us huh. know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Oh. Good news is, Lovely. The say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy thing. Okay, I remember a long time ago I wasn't ever able to- wait, what? What? Why can't I- Oh. A long time ago I remember this part. This part right here. I remember for some reason I wasn't able to complete it. But now I do, no. Wait, I thought these were pre-recorded messages. I thought that I thought these were pre-recorded messages, though. 
Like, whoa, okay. Oh, yep, it's gonna be pumping out of the thing here. What happens if I get covered in it? Will I die? No, does it just... It does not like the human skeleton. Pretty sure I'm a human. I don't think I'm a robot. Maybe I am. I no, I'm not. Whoa! Oh, there's no... Okay, I think I'm supposed to cover this place in repulsion gel. That would make sense. Putting repulsion gel everywhere. It's just pretty awesome. Alright, let's see if I can jump up here. Oh, okay. So I'm supposed to put some gel here. Jump up. Oh, I see. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. He okay, wait. I think I'm supposed to do this. He Sweet. Alright. Cool. Now come over here. And put one down there. Boop. Oh, it's pretty cool that it doesn't uh, screw up when it's. Oh, I see how this works. So I'm gonna fly out of there. Then I'm gonna bounce on there. Oh, I think that's how it's gonna work. I don't know. See. Yeah! Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, oh. don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Well, thanks! <laughs> I mean, I didn't get any of that coffee, whatever. It would be better if you didn't tell us that. <laughs> Now they're probably. That's just. Now, if you're part of Control Group Kepler 7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're gonna need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Oh! That's not good at all. And that's above boiling point, too, so. That would not be good for your brain. I'm just gonna say. What's this? Is this a new gel already? Or is this water? This is a total waste of water. And it's completely dry, too. Huh. Portal 2 physics for ya. Is this water, or is this, uh... Actually, I think its official name is, um... Cl cleansing gel? But... I'm pretty sure it's water. So gel's coming out of there. Oh, and look, there's the gel flow pipe. There's another gel flow pipe. Cool. All right. Oh, you can't place gel there. Wait. Oh, okay. That button turns off the water, I bet. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna put that there. Uh, okay. No! Okay. Almost didn't do it. Oh, and it just cleans right off. So apparently... This next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. Well, so, what? Word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Remember, Lab boys tell me how to wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So Whoa. do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. 
Remember, if a future you tries to warn you about this test, don't listen. That's... okay. It's kind of weird. Wait. Uh, okay, I think I'm supposed to jump here. Whoa! Hey, that could've worked. Wait, 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 wait. Am I supposed to do something here? Okay, I think I know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna fly up, bounce, go over there. Sweet. Alright. This repulsion gel stuff is fun. Portal 2 is so fun. They added a little a lot of cool stuff in it. Woo! Well, here's the tube that it's coming out of. Awesome. Okay, where do I go now? Right here? Oh, wait, no. There's a catwalk right, uh, stairs. Catwalk, yeah. Could be a catwalk, I guess. I think I remember this part right here. Uh, put that there. Can I reach the repulsion gel? Yes, I can. Awesome. And look at that. Beautiful. And I think what's gonna happen, I'm gonna fall out of there. Okay. Hopefully this is how it works. Wee! Awesome. Not that way. Am I supposed to go here? What? What? Where am I going? I'm... Okay. I'm supposed to... Where am I going? I'm, s I'm still in the sphere here. Yeah, I am. Oh, I'm s okay. I'm supposed to jump. You're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalk between tests. What? No, I'm not. I always say that might be a fear reaction. One sec, guys. And we're back. I, uh, there was some really funny dialogue that, uh, Cave Johnson said. And I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I think I see what to do here. Whoa. How's this gonna work? Oh! Oh! Was I meant to do that? Oh! Hold on. Hey, I've got a blue cube. Wait. Oh, I can't pick it up. I can't set it down. That's kind of lame. Oh, am I supposed to coat it in this water here? Yeah, that's awesome. Whee! Oh, this is going to be the last test, and I'm going to leave off the recording, okay? Why am I talking... Why am I saying it like I'm actually talking to someone? I'm really, I'm a really weird person. But yeah, I'm just going to leave off the recording after this. That was really awkward. Cringeworthy. Oh, stop it. Wait, the gel is just going to keep falling. That's funny. All right. I supposed to drop the stuff on it? But what? How did it miss? There we go. Science is about why. It's about why not. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not merely save science that they love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that will keep you on the bus on the way out? Because you are fired. subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you. Box your stuff out the front door. Oh. Wow. What a savage. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to leave it off here. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Hope you enjoy the content on the channel. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.